actually started, we'll sort of recap what we've already said. Um, so we're we're looking to actually reduce the number of days we stream now down from two to, or from four to two because there's just I have to work, <laughs> I have um, like should I have to do around the house? I have to deal with taxes. <laughs> like there, there's just stuff that comes up that I have to deal with. Um, and there's just not enough time in the days. There just isn't. I love to stream as much as I'm a cutie pie, but until, like, I have a stream as big as I'm a cutie pie, I just can't. <laughs> uh, which is whatever. It's fine. I'm not expecting to have a stream as big as I'm a cutie pie ever. But, um, it's important to, like, relax and enjoy League and get a lot out of it. Because, I mean, if you, if you read the description of the video, every video says we're doing this all in the name of, like, equanimity. And what I mean by that is to, like, have fun and enjoy ourselves. And, God, I also need to go through these wallpapers and get some of these, get rid of some of the more risque ones. Like, this makes me laugh, but I probably shouldn't be putting this on stream. <laughs> Anyways, listen to me. Stop laughing at the pun, the very, like, risky pun behind me. <laughs> the, um... The lesson for today isn't necessarily like, okay, let's review a game and see what we did wrong, what we could learn. Here's what the lesson for today is, because it's actually completely relevant to uh, Creamy Crimes. Welcome, my friend. Uh, it's completely relevant to why we're actually reducing the number of days we're streaming back from four to two. And it's because today I came in, and so yesterday I had to cut the stream short a little bit so I could go do prep work and uh, an evening event for uh, my job. And then today I had to start the stream a little late because I had to do the morning event that we did prep work for last night this morning and it lasted all the way in the morning so i got up really early like ungodly early today um which is fine it's whatever but <laughs> like to to have that sort of start to the day and then go do a bunch of like really intense physical work um which it wasn't all day but especially at the end it was i ended up like carrying a 40 pound box and like there's the cardboard cut me a little bit on a couple spots that's the only one that really shows up on camera but um so to come back and then hop into game here and be like hey i'm just gonna play top on norms today because fuck it, we're having fun that's fine and it's great i was doing really good at the start of the day and then we started playing ranked a little bit. I was doing good at first. Uh, again, top not my home role, so I wasn't expecting to do good. I was actually expecting to bomb really hard if I started doing that. But I was like, yeah, fuck it. Let's do it. If we bomb really hard, it's not a big deal. Um, which is fine. But, you know, I do want to do well, and I do want to improve. And the problem is if I'm playing and doing so poorly that I play to where, like, I'm not even, like, thinking... And, like, I'm just sort of, like, doing whatever, like, my natural mechanics are and not paying attention and not even really, like, thinking things through. And when I do try and think things through, I, like, make an egregious error. Like, one time when I was TPing back, I, like, started the TP and then was buying the items. But then, like, I had a moment of indecision of what item I wanted to go first. So then we came back to lane with, like, 800 to 1,000 gold or something like that unspent. And immediately we're in a fight because our jungler was coming. So it was like a TP back to lane right as a gank was happening to try and get a kill. Excuse me, try and get a kill. And like, we still got the kill. Great. But, like, that's really bad. That's a horrible misplay. We should never do There's no reason we shouldn't have had all of our items, like, prepared for that. Um, so that's bad. And, like, that's an example of, like, just mental fatigue, right? And it's not necessarily because I'm just streaming so much, but, like, there's stuff that goes into the stream beyond this. All the technical difficulties, I have to troubleshoot every day, pretty much every day. <laughs> um, editing the videos, like, I'm actually trying to really improve my editing skills to make the YouTube content a lot more engaging and more eye-catching for people. Um, and a lot more easier for you guys to consume. Because, like, just like we go through all the extra effort of, like, having a three-point lighting system and a green screen and, like, the mic is all the way across the room to try and get it at an appropriate level for you guys so it's not like Mr. Roboto voice. Um, I, I'm trying to go the extra mile on those YouTube videos as well and improve my skills as an editor so those can be a little bit higher quality for you guys and be something like um, random lull moments or something like that. Something of that caliber where they have like transition frames and sound effects and recurring like intros and outros. All that stuff I want to get for you guys. And it's hard because I don't know how to do that. I'm trying to learn it on the fly. And, you know, when I'm working, like, every day of the week, before, like, I actually cut down hours at my day job to try and, like, create a, um, like, day off 
where I could focus on the like behind the scenes work for the stream, like uploading content and like editing content and like teaching myself how to edit content the way I want to. And like trying to troubleshoot things and just like develop more uh, like graphics for like the uh, different like schedules and stuff for you guys. All that stuff I'm trying to develop. And I, and I created like a day off for myself to continue to do work during. And that's just not right. Like that's just, I'm so exhausted and I'm just like mentally fatigued. And today was a perfect example of the ending today. Like I just am in a fog right now. I'm not playing, I'm not thinking. I am playing, but I'm not thinking. <laughs> like what if I'm in ARAMs, that's fine. Or if I'm doing Doom bots, that's great, who cares? But like, my play range, I should be fucking thinking, you know? I should probably be thinking about my plays. And uh, like it sucks to say that I'm going to have to like reduce the amount of time I'm streaming, which probably I would think in my mind would mean I'm going to do a little bit worse because I'm going to be more rusty more of the time. But at the same time, maybe I won't have this mental fatigue anymore. And I think giving yourself that flexibility to try and figure out like what level of engagement works for you, I think like more time on League is probably what I need to improve. Um, but at the end of the day, I gotta work, you know, and I gotta like I have responsibilities and like obligations to other people I gotta keep. So like I'm not gonna just bail on that to play League <laughs> my entire life <laughs> as much as I would love that. Um, but I think it's this is a, these are lessons that hopefully are applicable to you as well. Um, and one of the things that has really resonated with me today that I think might be applicable is I think it's going to be the right decision to try and reduce the amount I'm streaming to two days instead of four because that will give me plenty of time to do the editing on the days off. It will give me plenty of time to like watch some pro scene stuff on those days off so I can actually like keep my head in the game. Oh, Miki Kazooie, no, we're not, we're not done streaming, but we're reducing the number from four, four uh, streams a week and down to two instead. Um, so, again, I think that's going to be helpful because it's going to help us have, for those two days that we are streaming, it's going to bring a lot more mental focus to the game. And I think I, like, it's one thing to get a whole bunch of hours in, but if I'm not, like, improving myself which is the whole point of the stream we're trying to get better if i'm not getting quality assessment out of that there's no point i could do twice as many hours and i wouldn't be getting better because i'm not thinking and improving and one of the things i want to do is like watch other people who are better than me play i want to watch like the pro scene to see like what they're doing and hear com professional commentary on the game so i can think okay like yes that makes sense as a strategy i should start thinking in these terms and those terms for these different lanes or these situations and i'm just falling behind on the pro scene and i like don't really keep up with the meta as much anymore and it's because i'm streaming so much which is great it gives me a lot of time to engage with the game proper uh but i need a little bit more time to theory craft and i need a little bit more time to like be present when i'm playing uh, and I feel like I've been struggling a little bit with being present when I'm playing. So hopefully experimenting with the schedule, it's not necessarily set in stone. We're going to say it two days a week uh, forever. I hope certainly not. <laughs> but um, experimenting with that for now and seeing if that helps us at all um, is something that even though it pains me to do, I think it's important to experiment with and try. Um, and there's always going to be decisions in your life where, like, you have to try something that's gonna like be like, ah, oh, this feels wrong. I don't really know that this is right, but I'm gonna try it anyway because what's we're, what we're doing right now isn't really working. Like I'm not really, I'm just, I've hung in gold four and gold five for like the past month, two months, three months even maybe. Uh, it's getting up there. <laughs> so we're not, we're not actively improving very much. Aside from we're expanding our champion pool quite a bit and we're playing a lot more different roles, but um, we're not really improving a whole bunch. And I do want to keep that improvement rolling. So we're going to try something a little different. And hopefully if you get yourself in a bit of a rut, maybe it's something with a schedule, maybe trying shaking up your schedule, um, maybe allocating more time or less time might help, maybe doing different things with that time. Allocate the same amount of time to leave, but maybe theory craft a bit more, maybe watch pros a bit more, uh, maybe just get more hours in, uh, on the game is uh, what you need. Hopefully uh, you guys can find that pattern that works for you and hopefully in this experiment we're going to find a pattern that works for me. I, I do hope we get more time 
uh, in on the stream because I really enjoy streaming with you guys. If you notice, I'm almost always smiling, even when we're doing bad. <laughs> I just love hanging out with you guys. Uh, you're cool people. So hopefully we get that back um, uh, up to four days a week. But hopefully that's helpful for you guys. Uh, and yeah, thanks for keeping up with all these uh, lessons. Hopefully we're going to have, hopefully, 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 we're going to have uh, some higher quality uh, edits coming up for uh, you guys in the next couple weeks. So look forward to that if you're watching on the YouTubes and if you're watching on the Twitch. Just thanks for hanging out, man. Stay tuned. We're still going to be here. Still going to be here. Fret not. We're still going to be here. Um, just not as frequent. So that's it for the lesson. Thanks for hanging out. See you next lesson.